What up everyone, Jimbo86 here, back again with another awesome video. Right, it's prediction time, fast lane is fast approaching, get it, fast lane, uh, fast lane is fast approaching, uh, it is this Sunday, um, I expect this video won't be up now until Saturday, I'm recording it Friday night at the moment, but yeah, this will be up Saturday, so technically by the time you see this, fast lane is tomorrow. <laughs> well, yeah, prediction time, so I might as well get straight into it, hadn't I? Um, I don't know if we've got anything announced for the kickoff or if the, the women will be on the kickoff. Um, how many matches have we got? One, two, four, five. Only six matches at the moment so, that I've seen on the WWE website. Um, only six matches booked so far for Fastlane. It's probably about right. They might obviously chuck something on the kickoff, but I don't know up until now what's going on the kickoff. Anyway, let's start. So we've got Becky Lynch and Naomi versus Natalia and Carmella. Uh, this match is kind of a nothing match really, doesn't really have any story behind it, there's no reason for it, it was just kind of something that got made on Smackdown the other night, backstage, um, between Carmella and uh, Naomi, uh, not uh, between, it was between Natal Natalia and Naomi actually, so, um, so yeah, it's a bit of a nothing match, I can only really see Becky and Naomi winning this one, um, so yeah, that's that one, like I say, it's a nothing match, so let's move on. Next match is Shinsuke Nakamura versus Rusev Day. Uh, I think Nakamura's gonna win and it will be known as Nakamura Day. <laughs> That's what Shinsuke said the other day. It's gonna be Nakamura Day. I'm actually quite a good singer. I'm, good as, I'm as good as Aiden English, I reckon better actually. Uh, so yeah, I think Shinsuke Nakamura's gonna win that because Rusev, um, to be honest, He's not really getting booked at all at the moment. He's like, you know, the most he's done, I think, lately is being at ringside for an Aiden English match. Um, he's like one of the most over guys in, in the company right now. Everyone's chanting Rusev Day. He's got Rusev Day t-shirts on, but they're not booking the dude. They're not booking him for some reason. Uh, and I'm pretty sure he probably won't beat Nakamura because Nakamura is like, you know, the one they're going to start pushing. Obviously, he's got the main event title match at WrestleMania against AJ Styles, hasn't he? Well, assuming AJ Styles, you know, retains on Sunday. But yeah, Nakamura, I can't see him losing to Rusev, really. Um, even though he probably should, but he won't. So yeah, Nakamura will win that one. Then we come on to the United States Championship, where we've got the glorious Bobby Roode versus the Viper, Randy Orton. Um, I don't think the title's going to change hands there either. Bobby Roode uh, is going to retain his title. Uh, Randy Orton will walk away empty-handed. And that would be that, really. It'll probably be an okay match. Randy's a very slow in-ring performer. And, you know, his matches are good, but not they're not nothing amazing. Bobby Roode's not bad in-ring. Obviously, he's a good in-ring performer. But, yeah, I don't I don't think that match will actually be fantastic. It'll be all right. But everyone's saving their self for WrestleMania, aren't they? <laughs> and then we've got... So, yeah, anyway, Bobby Roode to retain. Then we've got the SmackDown Women Championship. Charlotte Flair is defending her title against... Hi, 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 hi! Ruby Riot. Now, actually, I would really like to see Ruby Riot win it. I would really like... I, I like Charlotte, but I'd like to see Ruby Riot win the title. But I don't think she's going to. I don't actually think any titles are going to uh, change hands at fast lane. to be quite honest with you. Uh, so, yeah, I'm just going to go over Charlotte Flair win. But I think that's going to be a real good match. And I do, I, I makes you wonder if, you know, the Riot Squad will get involved, beat down on Charlotte Flair. Because, I mean, Naomi and Becky Lynch have, uh, have got their own match. So, whether they'll come out and help Charlotte Flair if the Riot Squad get involved or not, I don't know. But then it makes you wonder, if the Riot Squad beat Charlotte Flair, will, they, will Carmella come out and try and cash in her briefcase? Her money in the bank briefcase? Who knows, who knows, eh? That could be something that could happen. Who knows? We'll have to just wait and see, I guess. But, interesting. But then again, the right squad might get Ben from ringside. Get out of here! Who knows? But yeah, I think Charlotte Flair will retain it against Ruby Riot. Uh, what happens after the match, I do not know. Imagine imagine she retains against Ruby Riot and then Carmella comes and cashes in. Or imagine Ruby Riot wins and then Carmella comes and cashes in. <laughs> And then we get a triple threat match at WrestleMania. Carmella, Ruby Riot, Charlotte Flair. I don't know. That'd be quite awesome. Uh, anyway, who knows? Then we've got the SmackDown Tag Team Championships. It's the Usos versus New Day Rocks. 
New Day Rocks. New Day Rocks. New Day um, Yeah, like I said, I don't think any titles are going to change hands, really. So I'm just going to say Usos to retain the titles. Sorry, boys. Sorry, New Day. I really like you. I really would like you to win it back. But I don't think you're going to win it back at Fastlane. Maybe in WrestleMania. Maybe WrestleMania, but I don't know. Then that brings us on to the WWE Championship. AJ Styles will be defending his champion his championship against John Cena, Dolph Ziggler, Kevin Owens, Sami Zayn, and Baron Corbin. So he's got to defend against five others. The odds are really stacked against him. Uh, we basically had this match the other night on SmackDown without John Cena, though. But we had like a, a, a fatal five-way. And uh, Sami Zayn won that one. But it's not to say that some of these will win it this weekend. So I think, as I say, I don't think any titles are going to be changing hands. So I think AJ will actually, um, AJ will actually retain. So it's going to be a good match. It'll be a good match. It'll be an interesting one to see what happens. But I do think AJ is going to retain. Pardon me. I I think the only, I mean, obviously there's a chance a New Day will win the tag titles, but I don't think they're going to win it. At fast lane, not so close to WrestleMania being just around the corner. Um, the only one I think possibly I possibly could change hands is the women's. I think Ruby Riot could possibly take the women's championship. Uh, obviously, with her having the Riot Squad in her corner, who knows? I think that's the one that's most likely to change hands, if at all. And uh, you know, we could get a surprise with Carmella cashing in a Money in the Bank. I know everyone's expecting her to wait until WrestleMania, which does seem like, you know, the the, the most awesome thing to do because it's WrestleMania. Everyone wants that WrestleMania moment. But if, if you know, if the moment seems right, then why not chuck Carmella out there and it will give the fans something to get like excited about. Like, what? Carmella's coming out now? So, uh, so yeah. So, I think that's, uh, that's the only one that could change hands is the women's, really. So, if we have a quick recap, I think Becky Lynch and Naomi will beat Natalia and Carmella. I think Chinsuke Nakamura will be the Rusev Day. Uh, I think that Bobby Roode will retain against Randy Orton. Charlotte Flair, like I say, I think she probably will retain, but there is a good chance, maybe I've got that wrong, and Ruby Riot will take it, or Carmella will come out and cash her money in the bank in. So, you know. Um, but yeah, it could be a Charlotte Flair retain, then Carmella comes and cashes her money in the bank in. Who knows? Uh, tag titles, it will stay on around the Usos' waist, I do believe. And then the WWE Championship, I'm pretty sure AJ Styles is not going to lose here at Fastlane. Because obviously, you know, we all want to see Nakamura versus AJ, don't we? We don't want to see, um, you know, Sami Zayn versus Nakamura at WrestleMania in the main event. Do we really, boys and girls? Definitely don't want to see Baron Corbin and Shinsuke Nakamura anymore. So, so yeah. So that's my predictions, everybody. Let me know what your predictions are by leaving some comments in the comment section below. Uh, what do you think is going to happen? Do you reckon Kamala's going to cash in her money in the bank this weekend? Uh, who knows? Anyway, I'm going to leave it there. If you like the video, then give it a thumbs up. If you're brand new to the channel and haven't done already, then make sure to hit that subscribe button. And uh, yeah, like I say, leave some comments. Let me know what you think is going to go down at Fastlane. So thanks, everybody, for watching. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.